Good morning guys, welcome to day nine of our UK tour. We're from some centre parks, day two of our weekend, well, weekday break. Sorry, I'm a bit out of puff and a bit out of whack. I'm about, sorry, growth. Six miles in to a 16 mile run. Yay! Oh, what a beautiful place to run. It certainly beats the streets of Manchester, but it's very, very, very hilly. Good morning again, I'm back from my run. Not sweaty, had a nice shower. And now I'm trying to cycle and film at the same time. Look at those skills. Just let me change gear. Hi. Oh. I've got a bruised bottom. My bottom hurts after yesterday. Shout, hi team. Hi. 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 Gotta go find Grandad. I'm gonna go and play table tennis. Why are you talking very fast? I'm not talking very fast. Right, I'm not sure how much I can film and go down this cascade walk. Let's see. Make some good footage. <laughs> He's going to make some great footage watching me go down here. Does someone go in front of me? I go, I go slower. Oh. Harry. Yeah. That way. This way. Uh. legs are a little bit stiff after a half marathon this morning. I didn't do 13 miles. Oh. You all right? Yeah, I just ah. Out, 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 out. Go slow. I really can't make these turns. Oh. <laughs> I think hopefully by the end of the trip I might be able to do it. I don't know what the secret is. Do I skid? Nah. Are you all right? Busy, 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 busy. won't work anymore. Whose idea was this? Yeah, it's great going down. The trouble is I've got to get my cup. Ouch, 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 ouch. It's a lot busier down here than it was last night. That's for sure. Sorry. I'm just going to park the bikes up and find Crazy Grandad and hope my coffee survived the bag. So we're just heading up to the sports plaza again. So that's where we had dinner over there last night. But this time we're going actually going into the sports plaza itself. I'm doing some table tennis. And we'll find some crazy granddad. So they do so many different things here. We've got table tennis, pretty bowling. Indoor golf, climbing, which the kids are doing later, snooker and pool, the fitness studio, 
which I've not booked in so far. So the cafe, Starbucks, double thumbs up for that one. Roller rink, which is always normally really good. Badminton, gyms, all sorts of different places. And obviously th these sort of things for the kids when they're when they're not so great. So, lovely great big place. So this is a reception area. And you can book things, change your bookings. A lot of bookings are already full up in the mornings. Oh, here we are. We've got our stuff. Yep. Four rackets. Bats. Bats. Not rackets, they're bats. Table turn. Fine grand. So here you can do badminton, which is looks really cool. Craft room, sports zone, indoor courts, the gym. I'll take you down there with a bit where Starbucks is. And you've got lots and lots of pool tables over here. And then the climbing walls are up there, which the kids are going on tonight. So the great tournament is on, it's Emily versus Harry. Who's gonna win? And it's a point to... Emily's just as bad as Harry. It's hard, you know. All right, I've not played it, so I can't say. Can Dad and I have a go? Plaza and table tennis. Safe to say, I won, right? No. No. Yeah, I did. Maybe not. Um, not too bad. Didn't do too bad. So we're just. In, I'm just in the outside area. The kids have got lots of treats now. We've got some walnuts for the squirrel, some bird seed for the birds. We've got some apple out because when I went for a run this morning, I saw a deer, which obviously, hopefully, you'll have seen the clip already. Um, we're just going to have some lunch now here obviously we've eaten out a lot the kids want to eat out again but no we're having a meal in well sandwiches um and then we'll probably eat out another day um alan has stayed down at the sports plaza because his knee can't make it back up the hill um and then this afternoon we've got swimming so the kids and david are off to the main dome area where all the slides are and I booked Har um, Harry, Alan and I into the aqua sauna. We're going for a spa for three hours. Um, nice, relaxing, chilled vibe. Three hours of spa treatment. Well, it was spa treatments. So there was no treatments left by the time I looked. Plus it was about £90 for a massage. I'm not paying for that. Um, so nice spa, wellness suite, like steam rooms, jacuzzis, saunas. I'll take my book with me, I think. Yeah, it'll be good. Um, so, David's just making some dinner. Right there, chef. Hot. No. All right, I'll better go and help David. I'm really bit. Hot. So I've just cycled down um, to the aqua sauna. So the aqua sauna is just next to the sports plaza, and it looks amazing. Let me show you what it looks like. I'm obviously, I don't think I'll be able to film. I won't be able to film inside. And quite frankly, I don't want to. So I just want to chill out and enjoy it. But it just looks fabulous. Now by the looks of it, there is a car park over there. Because as far as I'm aware, you can actually book um, spa breaks if you're not staying at Centre Parks. So I'm pretty sure you can. So. I did wonder how they got here, so there is a car park over there 
So that's probably how you do it. If you just drive up here and you can book into the spa even if you're not staying at Centre Park, which is fabulous. Um, I haven't got any Centre Parks near us. <laughs> right, gonna go and find Crazy Grandad. The kids and David are at the pool, going on the slides. I can't wait to chill out. So no doubt, I'll probably speak to you after I've finished, unless I can film some sneaky shots while I'm in there. at the aqua sauna i am now back in the um, sports plaza uh, waiting for the kids to go climbing the aqua sauna was amazing i wish i could have shown you around but obviously we weren't allowed to take cameras in there uh, it was just incredible lots of different spa rooms sensory rooms chill out areas it was just three hours of pure relaxation and heaven i'm so tired now though so we're back in the sports area and the kids are about to go climbing um, let me show you. So the kids are just having their briefing and getting their harnesses on. Uh, can't see him now. All you can see is his head. Well, these look really challenging. I'm not sure I could climb any of that. Maybe the um, baby one over there. There's Harry going up the lightning bolt. I know. In. And we're cooking in the kitchen, cooking in the storm. The noisy kitchen. That's because we've got a noisy chef. Chicken. I think we've got a salad. It looks like lettuce. Where's the cucumber? Um. I haven't done the cucumber because I thought you'd take the piss. Why? Because it'd be like, oh, where's the rest of the salad? Well, the 
it just leaves at the minute. Well, can I can do cucumber. Um, that smells good. So, freshly seasoned. Myself. I'm missing in that. Have you checked the draining board? What draining? Or in the dishwasher? One of those things that we don't have at home. Ah, yes. The magic cupboard. Hope we all sleep well tonight. Why? How was climbing? Uh, Harry? Tiring though. Tiring. Mm -hmm. right. Your arms are going to be hurting tomorrow for canoeing. <sighs> oh. Kayaking. Yeah. Kayaking, sorry. I think Emma's going to have the shakes tomorrow. She's going to need to double load on uh, sugars. A little bit of rest on that. Dinner was lovely. I had a nice glass of wine too and a bottle of beer. Just heading out on a bit of a walk. Gonna go and catch the land train. Um, Centre Park's Longleat is massive. So this part of the um, park is miles away from anywhere else. So they have a land train that goes all the way around. So if you haven't got bikes and your legs are a little bit stiff, then you can catch the land train. You get a map and a guide and times guide and it tells you where you can get it on from and what time it's supposed to come so it's supposed to come in about 10 minutes 10 minutes 10 minutes, 10 minutes. so we're going to catch the land train and take you on a ride change of plan we decided to walk don't know where we're going what we're doing don't know what time the shop's open we're just going for a walk We're just down at the plaza and how amazing does this look right now? So this section here is the outdoor rapids that are amazing and you probably would have seen Fussy Good Days of Emily and Harry in those. But we're coming at this time tomorrow night and it looks fabulous. Is the outdoor pool and that bit's the rapids. There's a Starbucks just there and guest services just on your left. And it looks like all the shops are shut already. This is the park market here at uh, Centre Parks. What's the matter? Last, uh, Last packet of Krispy Kreme donuts. They're going to be well stale. Yeah, but it's donuts. Donuts. Yes. Oh, they sell donuts. disposable barbecues. Eleven pounds. Marshmallow. Wowzers! I might buy that though. Barbecue chocolate and some marshmallows. I mean, it's not bad. Have you seen how much the... Oh, two for £11. Duh. So, nice selection of sandwiches. It's actually run by the co-op, I believe. Ooh, chocolate donuts.
Can I get some lemon iced tea? Lemon iced tea. Can I get some lemon iced tea? <gasps> Look at that selection. Yep. Really, really good selection of meats and sausages and bacon. <laughs> what are you laughing at, you guys? Nothing. <laughs> Southern fried chicken meal for two. Oh, mini fillets and fries. Wow. That's good, isn't it? Peppers. Is it your favourite? I like mini chicken very much. Go balls. And what's it called again? You have got some fresh fruit here, some fresh. Go on. It's Nemo! <laughs> and the Minion! The Paw Patrol. That looks lovely. Get afternoon tea. How you saying? Coffee. Coffee. You two doing? Can't take these two anywhere. So you have got a selection of baby stuff. If you have a a bambino, do I have a bambino? Yes, we are. Should we get some chocolate bars? Chocolate. I want a chocolate bar. What do I want? Out the way, filming here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm oh, a bit mick. Should get some two. Should we get the word? The word, I think. Picnic, please. Picnic. Muchos, muchos gracias. Stuff for celebrations. So if you're celebrating a birthday or something, look what you've got. I mean, I'd be a bit pissed off if someone bought me a present for me, yeah. But the thoughts there. This range of ready meals is supposed to be really, really good. So I realised I didn't end the vlog last night because I was knackered, exhausted, cream crackered, however you want to say it, I was just totally wiped out. Had a fantastic day yesterday, um, obviously big run in the morning, then what else did we do? We played table tennis which was quite a good fun, the kids got the hang of it eventually, Harry was much better at it than Emily which I'm normally surprised at. Um, then Alan and I went to the sauna which was brilliant. It's about £49 for three hours session in the in the sauna. Um, but there is about 24 different experience rooms, probably about seven sort of steam rooms um, and saunas. And then you've got lots of chill out areas. You've got an outdoor area with jacuzzis and hot tubs, which didn't get to go in. Um, and then you've got the main, like a little pool in the middle with the, like bubble jets and stuff like that. That's on a 15 minute cycle. You go for a bit of a swim. It's sort of indoors, outdoors. It's got no roof on it. So that was lovely, it's lovely and warm. It was just a really nice chilled experience. There's also a cafe in there. The treatments you um, have to book prior to as well if you wanted a treatment. There is no point booking it during your vacation, or during your vacation, during your holiday because they will already be booked up. Um, we looked for a massage and there was one left on Monday night and then they'd all gone. Um, yeah, so that was, they are quite expensive though. They're about, £90 for a massage, I think I probably mentioned it before on the vlog, 
I can't remember what I've said and what I've not said. But it's well worth it. If you just want to have a bit of a chill out, then I would definitely recommend it. It was so lovely to experience. Then what we do? Oh yeah, the kids did the climbing. We had some dinner. Um, we just obviously cooked at home. And then we went for a walk in the evening. And by the time I got back, I was utterly, utterly exhausted. I literally couldn't walk back up here. So when I checked on my um, my watch, I'd done 35,000 steps, walked 91, no, yeah, 35,000 steps and walked up 91 flights of stairs. And I just crashed. I'd literally hit the wall and I crashed when I got back. So that is the end of that vlog. So don't forget to give us a big thumbs up. Leave any comments down below. Have you ever been to the Aquasona? What did you think of it? Um, I'd love to hear from you. And I will catch you in the next one. We're excited to day from tomorrow.